There was a time when Stone Age men and women used to sit and look up at the sky and say, "What are those twinkling lights?" They built the first curriculum, but we've lost sight of that wondrous question. We brought it down to the tangent of an angle, but that's not that, that's not sexy enough. The way you would put it to a nine-year-old is to say, if a meteorite was coming to hit the Earth, how would you figure out if it was going to or not? And if he says, well, what? How? You say there's a magic word. It's called the tangent of an angle, and leave him alone. He'll figure it out. So here are a couple of images from Souls. I've tried incredible, incredible questions.、Um, when did the world begin?、Uh, How will it end? To nine-year-olds.、Yeah, this one's about what happens to the air we breathe. This is done by children, without the help of any teacher. The teacher only raises the question, and then stands back and admires the answer. So, what's my wish? My wish is that we design the future of learning. We don't want to be spare parts for a great human computer, do we? So we need to design a future for learning. And I've got to hang on. I've got to get this wording exactly right, because you know it's very important. My wish is to help design a future of learning by supporting children all over the world to tap into their wonder and their ability to work together. Help me build this school. It will be called a school in the cloud. It will be a school. But children go on these intellectual adventures, driven by the big questions, which their mediators put in. The way I want to do this is to build a facility where I can study this. It's a facility which is practically unmanned. There's only one granny who who manages health and safety. The rest of it's from the cloud. The lights are turned on and off by the cloud, etc., etc. Everything's done from the cloud. But I want you for another purpose. You can do self-organized learning environments at home, in the school, outside of school, in clubs. It's very easy to do. There's a great document produced by TED which tells you how to do it. If you would please, please do it across all five continents and send me the data, then I'll put it all together, move it into the school of clouds, and create the future of learning. That's my wish. And just one last thing. I'll take you to the top of the Himalayas, at 12,000 feet, where the air is thin. I once built two hole-in-the-wall computers, and the children flocked there.、And、there was this little girl who was following me around, and I said to her, "You know, I want to, I want to give a computer to everybody, every child. I don't know what should I do." And I was trying to take a picture of her, you know, quietly. She suddenly raised her hand like this, and said to me. Get on with it. <laughs> I think it was good advice. I'll follow her advice. I'll stop talking. Thank you. <laughs>